What's up? I'm Aaron Cartier and welcome to my YouTube channel. Hello beautiful people and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all four different looks that I feel like are going to be great for spring. Now these are going to be looks for running errands, for going to brunch, to just, you know, going out and wanting to look cute, to going to a night out. Now these are going to be outfits that I love that I have styled previously for myself, but I feel like they're going to be great for spring. Some of these are going to be things that I put together today for the very first time, so we're going to see how they look, but I feel like they're going to be great for the spring occasion. You know, it's still rainy outside, and sometimes it's still cold. One minute it wants to be 50 degrees, one minute it wants to be 70 degrees. So we never know what Miss Spring is going to give us. But with these four looks, you can wear them for different occasions. They're going to be giving you basic ideas or kind of giving you help on how to style different things. They're going to be masculine. They're going to be feminine for everyone because I know people love to dress differently. So I'm trying to mix in the masculine, the feminine. And if you are interested in purchasing some of these outfits, I will try to find some of the links um, to try to link them in the description. Some of these outfits and pieces I have had for a long time, so they're probably sold out or not being sold anymore, but I would definitely try to find replicas or try to find something close, you know, to kind of give you that bit of inspiration for when you're going out with your girls or with your guys. Alrighty, so I'm going to be kind of out of the frame just a little bit, just so I can insert the video here for you all so you can see the outfit and all that good stuff. So the first outfit I feel like will be great for brunch. Now this is going to be a floral top that I got from ASOS. When I saw this top, I was immediately drawn to it because it kind of gave me a set 70s type of vibe, a 70s style, 70s style feel with the flair or with the pop of the color, the flowers, and then especially the collar, how it has a long kind of triangular collar. It kind of gave me a 70s type of vibe. And then I want to style it, of course, with some nice Gucci Daddy shorts. Or in these cases, these are kind of some booty shorts. They're real short and they're distressed. And I thought these are perfect for spring. Kind of give me that feminine type of vibe that I kind of like to mix and match in my wardrobe. And then, of course, I style with a nice bag. Now, I do not have a lot of colorful bags, so I just styled it with one of my favorite black bags because all I have is black. Now, our next look is going to be a going out look, and this is one of my favorite outfits that I got from Boohoo. I actually got this in two different styles. I believe I wore this in a video before, and it's going to be this all black denim look with the metallic stars all over it, and I love this outfit. I got this probably two years ago, and I would say I wear this down to the ground. I feel like this is the perfect outfit for going out because I feel like it's casual but it's also still doing the most which I love casual extraness and I feel like the denim is going to keep you nice and warm because sometimes it's still cool at night and then you also have the metallic stars it's going to be the extra bit of pop the extra bit of oomph the extra bit of showing off and I feel like this is perfect for going out and then I of course styled it with my favorite trucker hat this baby boy hat if I can find a link I will tag it because I love this hat and I want him to come out in some more colors. He has a baby boy and a baby girl one and they're both so cute. I wear this hat like so freaking much especially on days when I have a haircut so we're going to imagine this being a I don't have a haircut day but yeah I love this outfit. It's one of my favorite. Of course I'm going to wear my chains with it because why not? The chains have to be on there. The chains have to be a part of it like just because and then I styled it with some aviator style sunglasses just because I feel like these were just cute. They were kind of make you stand out. They're kind of doing the most and they're just extra. Who doesn't love a good aviator, especially an oversized aviator? And I actually got these from Sheen, so or Sheen, however you pronounce it. I don't know how you pronounce the name, but I will try to link it down below if I can find that as well. But this is a good fun going out outfit. You can take the jacket off. You can wear a tank top underneath. You can wear a basic black top or you can where if you want to match the silver, maybe do a gray top just to match, but I would probably do a black or a white just because you want the chains to stand out. I feel like up against the gray, it's kind of going to fall in and not really be matching. So I love this Fortnite spring going out outfit. It's fun. It's definitely a conversation starter. It definitely is going to make you stand out in the room if you like being extra, but you like being casual at the same time. Now our next spring outfit is going to be kind of a running errands outfit, but it's going to be kind of a running errands, but you want to be extra type of outfit. 
And I feel like this can kind of transition into a nighttime outfit too, especially in the springtime. Say maybe you're out running errands and then one of your homegirls, homeboys calls you and is like, hey, let's go do lunch or hey, let's go to this day party. This will be a great, I'm running errands, but now I'm about to go to a day party type of look. So let's call it a day party. I feel like a day party is good. And I actually got this kimono from Forever 21 a long time ago, like so long ago, like 26. 16 probably is when I got it and I've still kept it this long because I just love kimonos and it's a nice silk kimono It's from forever 21. It still stood this test of time and I really love it And then again, we're going with ASOS once again ASOS came through with me on these jeans these jeans I've had for a long time, but I love them because they're kind of like a metallic Distressed type jean. They're kind of shiny and have a sparkle and a sheen to them. And like I said, that's why it's that bit of extraness, but still kind of casual and perfect for springtime. And then I just paired it with a nice regular white tee that I kind of tucked in a little bit just to kind of give it a bit of a dressier element. And then I wanted to add a pop of color and just do something different. So I paired it with these aviator sunglasses that I got from Amazon that have a bit of a yellow tint to it, just because I feel like it just helps bring out a bit of color color in that kimono because it does have a bunch of different colors so I feel like it just tied it together all good and nice and then lastly I paired this what do I call it a Bottega Veneta dupe bag that's also from Amazon and I feel like it just helps bring out the color a little more it kind of bring out that white tee I don't know how to describe it. I feel like it just brings it out more it keeps it casual but it keeps it doing the most like I could go and I can go to a have me a bit, a bit of champagne in this outfit too, and I still look good. I feel like it's a great transitional outfit because I'm going to run errands, now I'm going to lunch, now I've got invited to a day party, and I don't have to worry about changing. I still look cute, I'm still giving what I need to give, and I'm still going to eat the girls up, and I'm still gonna make myself known when I walk into the room being extra, but being casual, what I say, casual extraness. So for this next look, I was trying to figure out how to describe it and where you would wear it. But I'm gonna say, let's say we're gonna wear or we're going to a springtime birthday party and it's like a grill type of event. Like they're having a barbecue, a springtime barbecue. And I feel like this outfit is nice because it's casual, but it's still extra and it's very monochromatic. It's all within the same color family with the browns, the tans, and they all kind of tie in together. And I got this top from, where did I get this from? I believe I got this top from H&M or ASOS. I can't remember because I got it a while ago. And I probably got this, I got this top probably in 2019. I can't remember exactly where I got it from, but I like this top. It has the nice buttons. I always leave the sleeves on button just to give that bit of extra kind of flare because I like when my sleeves are kind of flaring about kind of giving me that nod back to the 70s because I'm obsessed with 70s style and then we have these nice kind of chino pants and I got these from H&M I got these from H&M a long time ago as well and the thing about me is I do get pieces and keep them from a long time because I feel like I can repurpose them and restyle them and wear them with other things you never know when you might need something and as long as they're in still good condition what is the point of getting rid of something unless you know you're never going to wear it again because I've gotten rid of things and I've been like damn I wish I still had that piece but I got rid of it and then I started with this nice wide brim hat this is also from H&M as well and it kind of gives me an Indiana Jones type of vibe it kind of gives me like I'm going on a safari so I feel like that's perfect because the grill is outside when you're going on a safari you're outside so it kind of ties in that whole kind of outside theme that I outside feel and then of course we had to keep the brown with the shades and I'm wearing these shades are also from Sheen or Sheen as well and I hope you didn't hear that noise but sorry that's my computer but it's also from Sheen or Sheen however you pronounce it as well and I just was really drawn to these because I kind of feel like they gave you that alien superstar type of vibe but we didn't know what alien superstar was just yet because that album wasn't out but it's just a cool funky type of pair of shades they're different they have this the top part is straight and then it has kind of a triangular type of vibe. I just feel like they were just cool 
They were edgy, they were different, they were something fun, and I was immediately drawn to them. All right, so that is going to do it for my four springtime inspired looks. I hope you all did get some inspiration from this video, kind of on, you know, the springtime is here and different things that you can wear, different things you can throw on, how to mix and match and wear different things of that nature. If you did enjoy this video, please make sure that you do give me a big thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below so you are notified every time I upload a new video. I upload a new video every Sunday. You don't want to miss out. And turn on that notification bell. You made it all the way through this far. You might as well go ahead and hit subscribe. You're still here. You're still watching. Go ahead and subscribe. Don't leave without subscribing. You made it this far. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. And until I talk to you all in my next one, make sure that you shine bright like a diamond. Bye.